Hi everyone. I have another bed bedside candle meditation for you tonight. I am using a red candle. I have a red plate behind it for the reflection of the candle flame. You can see that. I wanted to make this um, share this with you in December because I know there are some people that suffer from something called SAD S-A-D-D and I had a friend who practiced nature based religion she had to have I think an artificial light in the winter because she suffered from SAD and I told her about this technique it's called drawing from the flame I'm also employing the color red This is very helpful when you need energy or you're suffering from exhaustion, which I am right now. And I've used this a few times in my life for um, every day until I got back my energy. This goes along with color therapy. Now, if you've ever heard of drawing down the moon, um, there's also the drawing of the sun, which they don't really recommend for people that are not intermediate but the, uh, the drawing from the flame anyone can do this is a miniature miniaturized uh, version smaller version of drawing from the sun it's called drawing from the flame or borrowing from the flame and what you do is you gaze at the flame for a second and you can even take your hand and imagine pulling that energy towards you and Breathing in the light of that flame. And you should be able to feel a tingling. You might not feel it right away. It might take you a few days. But if you do this every day, you'll start to feel the energy. And then, you know, gaze at the reflection of the flame and the or gaze at the color of the candle. Now I had a blue goblet that I would use to gaze at the reflection of the flame. And uh, if you suffer from anger issues or depression, I don't really recommend working with the color red for any number of days. I would recommend blue. But for me, I'm a water sign. And I really needed to get that um, Mars Aries red energy back in me. And so I did this at uh, one point in my life when we had moved our mobile home. Uh, it had been in one place for about six or seven years. And when we uh, moved it, to the new location I felt like an uprooted tree and I couldn't even go to my college classes I was so exhausted and so I laid beside this candle several times a day and I drew from the flame I borrowed from the flame breathed it in and gazed at the red color for I would say at least 20 minutes or more and it took me two weeks but I did get my energy back and I didn't know about drinking water or electrolytes anything like that I didn't have emergency vitamin C powder um, and, but I did gain my energy back I did it took two weeks but this worked and uh I think that if you are suffering from sad, it's, it's, it's worth trying. It's worth trying this, you know. We are connected to nature, and we have forgotten that. And you do not have to... Well, a lot of, a lot of spiritual practices and ancient religions focus very heavily on the flame. The life force energy is represented in the flame. But you don't have to change religions. Um, candles are extremely popular 
for several reasons, and this is one of them. We just don't yet remember or understand that we are a part of nature and uh, we need this connection. So give it a try, and I will see you soon.